Welcome to a brand new episode, Morning Devotion. We will be looking through the Bible every morning. Today's special guest on your favorite podcast is Reverend Dozy Maname, a pastor, father, and an evangelist who loves the Lord deeply. In this episode, you are going to learn how to begin your day with Jesus through His Word. Joshua chapter 1 After the death of Moses, the servant of the Lord, it came to pass that the Lord spoke to Joshua, the son of Nun, Moses' assistant, saying, Moses, my servant, is dead. Now therefore arise, go over this Jordan, you and all these people, to the land which I am giving to them, the children of Israel. Every place that the sole of your feet will tread upon, I have given you, as I said to Moses. The Bible says in verse 1 that after the death of Moses, Moses was the one who exemplified the law of God, but could not lead Israel into the land of promise and rest. However, this all happens after the death of Moses. The second part of the verse says, The Lord spoke to Joshua. Remember, at this time, Joshua was not a young man. He had spent his entire career before this passage as the assistant of Moses. Now is the time to take up the mantle of leadership. Now is the time for Joshua to lead his people, but only after God had prepared him. Joshua was prepared by faithful service in small things. In just being Moses' assistant. Then verse 2, verse 2 and 3. Verse 2 and 3 says, Moses, my servant, is dead. Now therefore arise. Go over this Jordan, you and all these people, to the land which I am giving to them, the children of Israel. Every place that the sole of your feet will tread upon, I have given you, as I said to Moses. My brothers and sisters, I want you to underline the word, your foot, from this passage. The entrance into the land of Canaan was entrusted to a representative, to a leader who lead his people, not a congregation. Hallelujah. Joshua was the trustee of the land for the people. In the same way, our representative Jesus goes before us, interceding for us. And what we have in God, we possess in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. The second word to underline in this passage is, I have given you. I have given you. The whole land was given, but they could only possess that which they claimed. Every place that the sole of your foot will tread upon, I have given you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What this verse means is that what they took must be fought for against a determined opposition. Hallelujah. Let me repeat it again. What this verse means is that what they took must be fought for against a determined opposition. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They can't just take it. They have to possess it through prayer, obeying God, and following him by following his leader, Joshua. Obeying God's instruction, praying always, 
God certainly could have simply eliminated all their enemies with just a thought or one word. But he calls Israel into partnership with himself to see his will be done. Hallelujah. 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 Because taking the land took effort. The challenges ahead was not for those content with Egypt, but for those who would press ahead for what God had called them to do. Now, what do we take away from this verse in Joshua chapter 1, verses 1 to 2? What do we take from this passage? A word to ponder this morning. Is, are you ready to possess your possession? Are you ready to take what rightfully belongs to you? Are you ready to pray yourself out from that situation, that trouble that troubles you? Are you ready to come out from that situation and say enough is enough? For he that is in me is greater than he that is in the world. I have Jesus who has power. And the Bible says in the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and every mouth shall confess that Jesus is the Lord. And I want to encourage you this morning to talk to God now. Talk to God now and possess that which belongs to you. Have a blessed day. Bye. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Please make sure to leave a review. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Also, follow us on Spotify and Google Podcasts. Hit the subscribe now and don't miss the next episode.